you know, coaching is not about the coach showing supreme knowledge or, you know, bamboozling the client's brain by asking questions that, you know, just confuse them or for the coach to show their supreme intellect. That's not what coaching is about. Coaching, you know, what we want to do with powerful questions is, is ask questions that's going to help the client to look at their situation probably from a totally different point of view that they've actually done to in the past. Really helping them to find a solution to the situation that they find themselves in at the moment. Now, remember what we said before is that we all take in information in our own way. We delete, generalize and distort and we've got our own internal representations. And so we are all individuals. Yes, we've got our own experiences. And so what might be a powerful question for one client might not be a powerful question for another client. So to say that I can give you an entire list of questions which are going to be powerful questions, well, that's a fallacy because you wouldn't know what is a powerful question until you actually speak and interact to, with that client. And really by using your active listening skills, really uh, hearing what it is that the client is saying, what they're saying, what they're not saying, and what are they saying with their language, what are they saying uh, so verbally and non-verbally, really paying attention to the client. And those are a number of skills that we're going to be learning as we look at the NLP part of the training. And so really paying attention to the client and being in the moment with the client, dancing in the moment. Remember, every client you know, they might be going down a particular uh, road or pathway and, you know, as you're coaching and as you're ans asking the questions, maybe the, the goal changes or the goal posts change and so therefore we need to adapt with our questions. So I can't actually give you a list and say these are the best questions that you can ask. Uh, I know there are people out there that say these are wonderful, powerful questions, those are the questions that you should ask. Well, to be fair, that's not coaching. If you go into a coaching situation and you've got a load of questions, you think those are the questions that I'm going to ask and you know that's it, then we're not serving our client. Uh, and in fact, I've, I've come across coaches like that and, and one lady in particular, she said to me, oh, every year you know, I buy the coaching book and, and you know, get the new coaching questions and, and those are the questions that I ask. Not coaching. Yeah. So as we coach, we want to really hear what our client is saying and dance in the moment with the client and then ask the right question and you know trust in yourself trust in your ability to be able to ask the right question to help move that client to the solution that they're looking for so all those questions that we've got on page 40 they simply ideas you know just to, to give you a bit of an idea of a type of question that you can ask but the powerful questions will come from you in your interaction with your client. So believe in yourself.